You're right, and it's it's even stronger right now out in Suffolk County. We have a new thunderstorm warning, I'll point out. But other folks are now taken out of the flood watches and the flood of flood advisories. So, you know, we take one step forward and a couple step, steps back. Let me show you uh, what we see for our day tomorrow, because today's been kind of a washout, and here's how, how it looks throughout the area. I'd say about 53 for New York City. You will see a little glimpse of sun in some spots out there. Not a great day. It's not a great day, but we're moving in the right direction. The weekend looks to be a good one out there. Now, 53 is my forecast for tomorrow. Take a look at what we have. For a high temperature today. And don't be misled by the almanac. Now, yes, this is the fact, okay? You had 46 for a high temperature today. 46 in and of itself, way off the mark, 12 degrees colder than it should be, but that was at 2.06 in the morning. At 1 o'clock this afternoon, it was 42 degrees. At this hour, it's still 42 degrees. Now, between 1 and 5.50 in the afternoon, you should find typically your warmest reading of the day. Uh, not for us. 42 degrees. You couple it with the winds that are blowing out there, and take a look at this. 42 feels right now like 33. It has been a cold, raw rain. You've had it all day long. Wind gusts 28 miles per hour right now, and those wind gusts, Look at this, 11:30 tonight. Still that same scenario, basically 25 to 35 mile per hour gusts for anybody. It's 11:30 tonight. Now you go through the overnight hours into your day on Friday, and by 2:30 Friday afternoon, they've come down a bit. It's not as windy; it's more of a breezy day. Not. You know, 25 to 35, more like 15 to 25 mile per hour gusts. But then you go into Saturday. Saturday, now you're done with this system. It's gone. Okay, the rain, the wet weather gone. But the winds have actually bumped up. And now you're looking at, wind, at winds uh, maybe 25 to 30 miles per hour for your day on Saturday. So it will be a breezy one. Taking a peek at the Vortex satellite and radar. All right, wherever you see the yellows or the oranges, that's where the heavy to moderate rain is. But notice from Staten Island over to Hunterdon County and south of that, you're in a pretty nice looking dry slot right now. Now, heaviest rain in the storms, you can see this, this line right there. Uh, if you can zoom in tight, you're going to find, okay, it goes anywhere from, say, New Haven, Connecticut, over towards Brookhaven, and out around the Hamptons and the North, North Fork, we've had some thunderstorms as well. And there's a little bit more offshore, but it's going to start winding down. But it's because of this line on top of Suffolk Haven, on top of Suffolk County right now, basically, there you go. Splitting the county right in two. It's right in the center section where the heaviest is, and we have that severe thunderstorm warning that is in effect right now. Uh, it'll probably be in effect, I would say, for another hour or so. We'll let you know about that. The bigger picture shows you there's your air mass for Saturday. Saturday will be a better looking day. Sunday, even better still. Let's go right to the extended forecast. We've had a very wet weather day today. You have some leftover activity tomorrow at around 52, maybe 53 degrees. But you're moving in the right direction. Like I said, you're 56 on Saturday with a sun and cloud mix. Sun Monday, pay off the better day of the weekend at 64, but it gets better. We are 70 on Monday. The Yankees are playing out at the stadium. That's beautiful baseball weather. 73 on Tuesday looks even better. So, just uh, got to fight through it. That's all. You just got to get through it. Yeah, tomorrow's not a great day, but it's at least better than today. You bet. Thank you, Lonnie.